Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls and children of all ages. Welcome to Pop How. Today's going to be a fun day. I've been thinking about this, and I know I do a lot of anime, and I do a lot of different stuff. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to change gears up. I've got some pops that I really, really like that I want to show you guys. There are a lot of stuff I keep out of box, so you won't see the box. You're just going to see the pops. And I'm going to showcase them off and some things that I... And I'll tell you a little story on each pop, the reason there's some of them I find kind of cool. And hopefully you do too. It's just a little bit of a different showcase and a little bit of something different. I'm going to spin some up together and I'm just going to have fun with it. And it's going to be a lot of random pops. Hopefully you guys like it. Now before I start, if you like today's video when it's all said and done, or even right now just so you don't forget, because we're not getting as many likes, go ahead and smash that like button. Let YouTube know you're really enjoying this. Helps get me to the alpha rhythm, get us all these things shared out again we're at 492 we're not at 500 so we're pushing that 500 subby giveaway right away once we get there i'm going to get some of that stuff going and along and hey if you're new here go ahead and subscribe after you subscribe there's going to be a little notification bell that appears right by that that lets you know we put a video out almost every single day go ahead and hit that it'll really help and guys let me know what your favorite pop you see today is just go ahead comment i'm gonna have a bunch of them up here we're gonna have some fun spinning some stuff up just let me know what you enjoy just thought i'd change gears here a little bit you know felt like we were getting a little cookie cutter -ish. and i wanted to have some fun today and i hope you enjoy this ride let me know what you think of today's video all right guys on that note what we're gonna do is we're gonna cue the intro and we're gonna get this bad boy started let's enjoy the ride cue it welcome to welcome to pop house, to house. all right guys Thanks for watching this thing. And like I said, this is going to be a random showcase. This right here is the bug from Starship Troopers. I just thought I would show it off. This one, uh, another one that I like to tell the story about how my son made sure his Naruto pops got in. This is the thing I want. It's only a $6 pop. Couldn't find it around here. Has never been in Michigan. Haven't been able to find it. But yet I found it when I was in Tennessee. And my son decided to stomp on it. And... Pop made it back perfectly fine. The box did not. It is the bug from Starship Troopers. Look at all the detail. And then I just thought that was a pretty sick looking little pop. The bug from Starship Troopers. Here we go. We've all seen the movie. At least hopefully we have. You know the movie. Happy Gilmore. The price is wrong. Beep. The price was not wrong. Happy you got your blank beat by Bob Barker. Yeah, Adam Sandler's funny. I really liked it. I think this is a pretty cool one. It's one I definitely display out of box. Bob Barker and Happy Gilmore. Now this is the Jawa from Star Wars. Bobblehead, bobble. Um, I got this one because it's kind of a neat little story. When we went to Disney... Um, the Jawas actually cornered a guy. They had him down there in Disney. We went to the Star Wars park. And it was really kind of cool. My son traded stickers and stuff to get the guy free. And there's a really couple of cool pictures of them. But my kids thought they were just so amazing. And so we ended up trading and bartering with them. And so my kids seen it and they're like, Dad, you need that pop. Dad, you have to have it. So guess what? Dad has that pop. I thought it was kind of neat. One of those little stories I just wanted to show with you guys, and here we go. Just because I could, you can see the bobbleheads. These are probably my two favorite besides Clown Pool of Deadpool. I mean, they're definitely my top two. Clown Pool might take Panda, but not that often. I like the little tail there on Duck Pool. I like to tell the story how I got Duck Pool in a mystery box, and I got a Travis Calise from the KC Chiefs with it, and Travis is like $180. I still got duck pool. Travis got sold. Had to keep duck pool. Duck pool, man. <laughs> All right. These are two of my favorite Bugs Bunny that I have. I wish I had the one with him in the opera to go with Elmer Fudd, but I do not have that one. But I do have him dressed up as Chiquita and his little top hat here. From, come on, my baby. Come on, my baby. Come on, my ragtime gal. You know, I'm a hot son. Far Bugs Bunny. Whoa. 
Wolverine. Definitely see the bobblehead on the zombie. Um, the other one kind of got caught up there. Bobble on the regular. Doesn't bobble as much on the regular. Wolverine is probably definitely my favorite comic book character. Um, I had all of his comics growing up as a kid. I had Wolverine's own series. I had a lot. Of, I had his first appearance, 180 and 181, in the Incredible Hulk. I have always been a huge Wolverine fan. So obviously, when I started collecting pops and they had Wolverine, had to do it. Couldn't turn it down. Wolverine. Then the zombie was something kind of cool to me. You know, I've got rid of my entire zombie line, but I kept the zombie Wolverine because I just couldn't get rid of it. Wolverine. Last but not least, Charlie Brown. If y'all don't know, I know it's Pop House with Animal, but my actual name, last name is Brown. I've been called Charlie a lot in my life, and it's just kind of cool. Charlie Brown. I had my kids convinced for a short period of time it was her cousin. <laughs> my wife said I was cruel. But Charlie Brown, really cool one. Um, always been a fan. I did want to get the Snoopy in the house. I just never have yet. But Charlie Brown is just a really cool pop to me. Let me know what you guys think about Charlie Brown. I like it. I mean, that's where I'm going to stop with my random showcase here. And like I said, be sure to smash the like button. And let me know which one of these was your favorite. And I'll see you here shortly. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed that. It's a little different video today. I just want to do something. Mix things up. Getting tired of kind of the cookie cutter. Easy throw together. Hey, if you liked what you saw today, remember smash the like button. Oh, yeah. I did that at the beginning. So guys, hopefully y'all have a blessed, beautiful day. I want to thank you for watching. If you have any suggestions of what you want me to do in a video, go ahead and drop it down. Um, doing a lot of fun stuff now. I mean, right now this week we got real versus fake. That's going to take me a little bit because I want to get some really in-depth photos in that. And hopefully you guys like that idea because I did get a fake Nejure so I can compare real and fake. So I'm going to get into all that stuff. I got a lot of photos in that. That video is going to take me a little bit to put together. And then at some time this week, I haven't decided what day I'm going to reveal who won the Naruto Soda. So, hey, if you haven't entered yet, go back to that giveaway video. Get entered because that's going to be this week. I'm not telling you when. It's going to be a random video that pops up says, hey, guess who won? All right. So on that note, I just want to thank everybody for being here. Give you a little bit of idea what's going on. I want to say hopefully you have a blessed, beautiful day. Um, one more time, Kanishiwa, Japan. I know I throw that out to them because it was a lot of fun. There, I hear there's a lot of little kids that watch me over there. And on that note, I just want to say peace.